Hello guys, this is Zuma, and welcome back to the forest. So we've been working over by the lake in the last few episodes. Um, we constructed a lake gazebo and a boathouse with some uh, tree platforms and tree bridges and things. That's looking really good. Um, our wall's looking really nice, going all the way around. So I think it's time to start extending it down this side. I think there's a cannibal underneath my base. Um, usually they always get trapped on the uh, the cave entrance there. Where are you? No one's been trapped underneath my base for a long time. Let's get prepared. I don't know where you are, buddy. You was underneath. Is that... Oh, can I get that back? <laughs> Thank you. You're stuck, eh? Is that a win? I think that's a win. Oh. Shit. <laughs> These sound effects, man. Oh, sorry. Oh, shit. She set back on fire then. I thought I was going to get hurt. So we'll bring the body around here near where the effigy tree is going to be. I have a few bodies around here ready and prepared. Drop you down there. So this is going to be our effigy tree using the uh, the new custom effigies that have been introduced in the game. I did say that every episode we're going to add a little bit to it. Obviously if I'm caving and stuff like that I won't be able to. But yeah that should be looking pretty good. So we'll do that a bit later. Um, that effigy is still burning. It said in the latest update that it was only going to last for 20 minutes instead of 40 but phew, it's lasted quite a long time. Let's get these going. The cannibals sometimes fall back into these. So, let's work on making this side of the base a bit more secure, shall we? Um, although they can jump over this rock wall, it's a bit feeble. I haven't actually seen any cannibal jump over it yet. But uh, we do need to extend it because they're just running right round and uh, getting in quite easy. So right, I have an idea. So as always, we're going to be making some happy birthday traps. Wherever they may be. Where are you? There we go. We've got the happy birthday traps. I haven't put one of these down in a long time. Which way does it go around? There we go. Yeah, like that. Okay. <laughs> I couldn't remember. Okay. I should probably be just going in a straight line. But I'm going to go up a little bit up here. It just means that when they're running along the wall here, they're going to have to then go up and around to try and get me. Whoa. It is the side where cannibals mainly come from. If I can patch all this up towards the plane, I should be golden. Is it just you on your own? Okay. Um, I don't really want to kill you, but I want you to move so I can build. So I think you're going to hit me in the back. I've got an idea. <laughs> it's a bit mean, but I don't know how to get him off. Oh, he jumped off. Well done. Right. Now we can play. Now my bow and arrow is fixed. We can have some fun. I can finally start using it. Wanted to get a headshot. You have plenty of time to run away, man. I love to know how that works, how you're on fire and your teeth drop out. It's a bit weird. I thought they lowered that in the last update. Maybe not. Oh, what is it with this? There we go. Where's the body? Oh, there it is. Because he's burnt, he blends into the background. I won't put him over near the tree effigy. I'll just put him over here for now because we need to get building. Okay, let's get on with it. I can see why people play on that meat-free one where the cannibals are in the game because they are a big distraction. But at the same time, it is fun killing them. I would actually like the cannibals to be even harder. Make it more of a challenge. So I think the happy birthday trap will be able to fill this nicely. Oh, well. Remember it's going to expand a little bit. Because the blueprint doesn't match the final version for some reason. It's been like this for a long time. There's like a little branch in the way. That shouldn't do anything. Oh, ooh, 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 yes. Stay away, bunny. It's a cannibal behind me. Just 
just the jumping chairs. What's that like? Um. Yeah, I did try to tilt it a bit more, but that's going to go to about here. So it will be okay. Where's our next one going? Get rid of that. I don't know if I'm going to be able to put a happy birthday trap there because of this big boulder, but we'll give it a go. This is going to be tough. Yeah, the, the boulder's in the way. Oh, went right for a second then. Come on. Stop fighting me. Please, come on. Damn it, I'm going to have to come off a little bit. Yes, oh, that, that's okay. Yeah, that's going to expand nicely. We need sticks. I found a lot of rabbit meat that's being cooked for some reason. I haven't burnt it with my arrow or anything. I don't know where it's coming from. But I ain't complaining about free food. Let's put these in. And 31 sticks. 8 logs. That ain't so bad. I've got no sticks this side. We've got some on the other side of my base. Oh, these have gone out. They didn't crumble. They just went out. That's strange. The reason why I was so hesitant to use standing fires all the time is because after a while they just crumble. That's good if they're lasting a lot longer though. Right, we'll start with the logs then. They're here. There we go. Six more. I've got them all down here. I chopped some trees down in preparation because all the trees came back. It makes it very easy. The cannibals are probably just going to run around this as well, but it, at least I'm making it more harder for them. I've noticed um, when I run forward, I make uh, the footsteps sound, but when I go on the side, <laughs> like I'm floating. <laughs> I am running. Strange. Uh, these are the last two logs. Right, just on the stick grind. Um, I've got loads of sticks over there, but might as well get them from here. Oh, yeah, Max Mahan carries 10. Two more. Hope there's not a gap there. Oh, yeah. What's this? away from my base. These two. Um, I need one more. There we go. Oh, how much is this going to expand? Nice. Let's see him try and get around there now. When that trap's down, it might be able to catch one of them off guard. Because he's naturally going to walk into it. I hope they just don't go, Oh, can't get over there, so I'll just jump over this. <laughs> oh, wait. Is it worth trying to put a rock wall on top of this already existing rock wall? I don't think the cannibals will be able to jump over two of them. It's got to be worth a try. Oh, come on. Oh, that would have been amazing. Oh, there we go. <laughs> I guess that's what you could do, but it doesn't look... Oh, 56 freaking rocks. That is insane. Could you do it from this side? Well, if you really wanted to stop them jumping over, that is one way to do it. 91 rocks, though. Good luck with that. I want no part of that. What about a stick fence? I think this is the one chink in my armour, this little rock wall. But if I could... Oh, 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 yes. Freaking show me the money. Genius. Oh, come on. 
Please, 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 please. Just, just, that, just a little bit further. Oh, do not do this to me. Shit. Um. All oh, right. Where's that bit going down? Oh, that's okay. Oh man, if this works, that is a brilliant idea. <laughs> and it looks good as well, it looks kind of medieval, and I can still probably fire my arrows through it. Oh. So I suppose you could do me a favour and try and jump over this. I want to test it out. Can you jump over it? Oh, it's still going round. You guys are a bit more aggressive, huh? Well, I guess you can beat the rods are in your favour, these four of you. I'm seeing a lot more of these golem looking ones. Well, the starving cannibals. There's so many come out through the day now. The leaders are sending them as cannon fodder. Whoa. Oh. Whoa. Have we got any fire arrows left? Yeah. Whew. Did he die? I think he did. Come on, face me, you little shits. <laughs> oh, well, that chair had a rocket behind it. Are they gone? At least they didn't jump over the rock wall. Oh. Oh, using this boy is so much fun. That is some weird sounds, dude. You had two friends somewhere, they've left you. If this works, I kind of wish I could just make a rock wall going all the way down here and then put a stick fence on top as well. But the rock walls at the minute just take far too much to make. It's insane. I hope that keeps them out. It's getting a bit dark. Can we skip? We're on a timer with a new update. I don't think we can. Nope. We're working through the night, guys. Which is really good. I love that update. Why should you be able to skip night time? Why should you? Let's fight the cannibals in the dark. <laughs> you merely adopted the dark. I was born in it. Molded by it. <laughs> Alright, enough shit bending impressions. Let's make it light. I guess I'm not too good at fighting in the dark. But we can collect uh, sticks and things like that. And then if it comes to combat, we can just hit them with this. It's about as good as an arrow. And you don't need booze either for this thing. It's pretty good. We need 26 sticks. What must they call that? Here we go. Oh. Nice. Shit. Pretty dark. <laughs> oh, you're right. That is just genius. I love that. I love that. It's that good it might actually be worth the pain in the ass collecting of all the rocks for the uh, the rock wall. Um, I'm screwed. I'm just going to get from the stick holder. I was going to hit branches with this thing, but if I've got all the sticks here, I might as well collect them. That was quick. Fastest collector in the West. When are the normal cannibals going to come out and face me, huh? Instead of sending the little golem ones, they uh, show the face. More sticks. Oh, I've got a lot from that. Oh, we got them all. That's all we needed. And it's gone out. Shit. Oh. Oh, oh, oh. some energy. That should be pretty close to the tree. Oh, yes. That's good. I 
I kind of like this corner. What the hell? There you go. <laughs> it's a rubber branch. Okay, defenses look good. I'm happy with this. Have these done anything? I don't think they actually kill anybody. They just um, they uh, they just increase the defense wall by 20% or something like that, or 25%. I can't remember which one it was. Although we've built up, we haven't really done anything. But um, we make it daytime yet? What is that? What is that? That is nothing. Oh, come on. Nearly there. It's like a little slice. A little slice of cake. Oh, oh. Ah. <laughs> well, that kind of worked out. It's still dark. Well, it is daytime, but it's still pretty dark. I think we have to make another one of these. I need more of this in my life. <laughs> this rock wall stick fence combination is awesome. So, am I actually gonna do this? I'm gonna make another rock wall. Why? Why would I do this to myself? On the run, they aren't very good. But then when you include the stick fence, magic happens. Oh wait, I don't even think I can actually put a happy birthday trap down, even if I wanted to. Let's try it out. Last time I had two blueprints overlapping, it got rid of one of them. So I might be forced into making this wall, which makes things a bit better, I think. I need this down, right? Right, is it? Needs to be more back a bit, I think. So look, that's in line. That might be overlapping too much. You know what happens when they're overlapping? When this goes down, it can get rid of it. In one of the episodes, I built a door next to a trap. And every time the trap went down, it got rid of the door. Even when I finished building it, it was crazy. Okay, so we'll be building this. Yeah, there's a cannibal over there. Okay, let's start this rock wall project. Uh, it's probably going to be a bit bigger than this one. Uh, just because I need to cover it past the uh, the happy birthday trap. What are you doing creeping in? Hi there. You just out for a stroll on your own? You want to help me build a rock wall? It's going to take me about 50 years to make it on my own, so I need some help. You brought someone along to help me? Don't hit me while I'm trying to build this, okay, you two. It's not really close to the tree. Seventy. Seventy rocks. Good job I've got a lot stored. What the? <laughs> oh. Can you jump over? Can you jump over? You can't even destroy it? I am definitely making this. That is the confirmation I needed. Thanks, buddy. Oh. He's pissed now. Probably because I hit him in the back of the head. I'm not going to use my bone arrow on you, man. This is all the blue axe, baby. I'm going to kill you with it. Let's go. Oh, get some energy. Uh, quick snack as well. Oh. It's called in the cavalry. I was keeping him up then. Come on, try and jump. Are oh, you coming back? Planets were going right through him. Yeah. 
Come on. That's how we do it. The plane axe upgraded is boss. Don't even need my bone arrow. Okay, so we've got some more bodies. <laughs> so, yeah, this is just going to be another little project, I guess. I can just start adding to it, but how good does that look? Putting another happy birthday trap here when there's a happy birthday trap there, it's just going to be a bit messy when um, it's down. Where did you come from? Where did you come from? Uh, I think he's dead. Do not get up. Uh, right, okay. Yes, yeah, so I'm just going to add bits to it all the time. Um, right, effigy tree. If you would come with me, good sir. We've got a tree with your name on it. Well, it's going to be with your body parts on it. Do, do, do. Uh, how many did I kill down here? Let's see if we can bring them over. Um, there's got to be some more dead around here. Seen some bodies around here? Yeah, I'd run away from me too if I asked that question. <laughs> Where were they? Never mind, I've got enough. Get the katana. Okay, so this is the effigy tree. A custom effigy that I've just started last episode. And I said we'll add a bit to it every episode. So we've already got the base down. So what else we got? Um, actually, I'm probably going to need some more sticks. If we want it like a tree, we're going to need the branches coming off. So for the effigy tree, think that the sticks are going to be like the branches and the body parts are going to be the leaves. If we stick to that, then we should be good. So we need some branches coming off. Um, this is all new to me, so this is just going to be trial and error. Yeah, I think if we can make it longer, that'll be good. Oh, perfect. Uh, this side. Fairly in line. Good stuff. All this doesn't have to be perfect and symmetrical and stuff, just the way a tree isn't. Uh, these branches coming off everywhere, that's what we'll have. Just getting the base down. Uh, where else? I'm just winging this. As long as we have enough branches to put all our legs and arms and heads and torsos coming off, we should be good. Yeah, like that comes a bit down. That's okay. Branches would come down like that. Um, where should we start for body parts? We're gonna have to have the torso in the middle to start off with. In fact, I don't know if it's quicker, but we'll use the katana. Strong neck. Can I pick you up? There we go. Oh. Oh man. Oh yes, it has. Oh, cool. It can go that way. Can it go upside down? Oh, this is sick. Oh, this effigy tree is gonna be dirty. <laughs> Um, I have already got limbs. We got rotten limbs. Um, just having bits coming off in any direction, really. If it can be nice and flat, that'd be great. Yes, yes, yes! I think it all needs to be arms. 
But if I come from this direction, the arm goes flat. Yeah. What the hell is that on? Oh, it is on. <laughs> it's the base of our effigy tree. Nice. So every episode, I think we should add to this and see how we can make it. I don't know. I think it's going to be pretty cool. But yeah, guys. Um, so it looks like we have a new project in the effigy tree and the rock wall. Which, oh God, actually, saying that, I've got about 40 rocks there. I've been uh, collecting them every episode in case I ever needed to build a rock wall. But yeah, this isn't going to be that bad. Cool. Um, so I'm hoping that those happy birthday traps had a bit more protection. That's going to be good. If you couldn't put a stick fence on top of a rock wall, I don't think I'd be making this rock wall. But I want a stick fence going all the way across this. And then we'll start the happy birthday trap thing going. Um, uh, coming from the rock wall, I think a happy birthday trap will fit perfectly between the rock wall and the tree. So then that gives me a bit more space from uh, my main base. And then I can put happy birthday traps going from here all the way down to here. And by then, we'll probably know how well this rock wall and fence combination works out. And we might put them all the way down to here. And then, I don't know, do something to the plane. And we've got the plane that they can't get behind. So that will complete the full perimeter. And down here we've got the little stick fence, which I'm never down here, so the cannibals don't really roam in from this side. This stick fence is doing its job nicely. With a noose trap there, that path leads down to the beach. So we've created ourselves a nice little open safe area, which is pretty good. So hopefully we are going to complete this circle. But anyway guys, thank you so much for watching. Hope you enjoyed the video. If you did, leave a like rating and I will see you in the next one. Thanks for watching guys and take care.